Please be advised, the following presentation is not intended for minors. Last stream, uh, I had a bit of feedback as to how to, you know, actually go about this whole playthrough. Uh, people really noticed, it's like, hey, you play shock a lot. You, you, you use that for, like, pretty much every encounter, unless, like, you already know that, like, a certain class or race actually has something interesting. And I'm like, huh, yeah, I did do that, didn't I? That's uh, kind of uh, kind of my fault for, you know, playing this game early. That's my bad. So, uh, with a little help with the... Uh, with a little help from my Discord, we've come up with, uh, with a solution to that. It also comes into, uh, you know, what they want to see as well with how this... Uh, playthrough goes because like i also asked them would you guys prefer a good campaign or an evil campaign and they said neither we want chaos <laughs> so what ha what we have decided to do bleh, what we have decided to do from now on is uh i have four d20s with me each d20 corresponds to a character whenever one character talks to an npc i have to roll these dice and whatever one uh, gets the highest result, I must immediately switch to that character, and they will be the party leader until the next character. So, yeah, we're constantly going to be swapping uh, characters, so hopefully that gets a bit more roleplay going. Also, uh, we have decided uh, who's going to be good and who's going to be evil. So, Shock and Donna are going to be the, like quote-unquote good characters, while Talon and Pharynx are going to be the quote-unquote evil characters. They do their own things in their own way, but, you know, we know the general, like, alignments of, like, how they're going to go. Anyway, since I've been, uh, you know, messing around with Shock pretty much the entirety of last stream, uh, I think it's about time we do our first roll. <laughs> Alrighty. Pharynx rolled a 20. Also, as I've noticed, uh, specifically for the uh, voice mod uh, stuff that I do, uh, I noticed during editing that these voices have a hard time with my accent. So when I have to swap over to someone, I'm going to try my hardest to do an American accent, so hopefully the voices are actually a bit more clearer. It seems like most are tieflings. They'll be fine. They have devilish powers. Ignorance is agony, my friend. I will include you in my prayers. I better get started, for your sake. That is not what I said. <laughs> Fucking oof. Shouting? Just immediately what? get called a racist because, of course. Right, this is another thing I kind of forgot about. Uh, to go with the whole chat wants chaos thing, uh, every time I fail a roll, I'm not going to use inspiration. <laughs> I'm not. We have to go with every roll that we get. So, rip. Why are you stabbing my head? Could you please not do that? Please. Ow. Advocatus Diaboli. Can you please put your sword away? Uh, might this concoction also help with something a bit more serious? Well, that depends. What's wrong, lovey? I have a condition. A unusual condition. Oh, I've seen it all. I once had a fella who'd been caught dabbling with a dryad. The no. wife was none too pleased and introduced him to a pot of boiling oil. Oh, that's even worse. But worry not. I fixed him up, and depending on the lighting, he looks good as new. My point is, whatever ails you, I promise I've seen worse. Oh. What is it, Petal? What's wrong? Luckily, it's not Dryad STDs, thank God, but uh, uh, I do have a Mind Flayer Parasite in my head. Nay, bother, love. Come back any time. Aw, ain't she sweet. And a free potion of greater healing as well. Quarter staff plus one. Technically, that's more damage. It's technically more damage for uh, Talon. You're one of those drow, right? I, I sure am. You. How you all live underground and steal kids away. 
Nonsense. We kill us far more children than we enslave. Oh. Okay. <laughs> um. Hey. Would you like to see something fun? Go on. Take this ring. It's lucky. Fancy trick. You haven't seen anything yet, mister. Go on. Take the ring and watch your fortune change. I'm gonna do the trick back at him. Oh no, 20 looks good. Weeping, bleeding hells. Simple okay, trick. Maybe you don't need extra luck. But since you're already holding the thing, call it heads or tails. Heads. Heads it is. See? That's the kind of luck you get from one of my lucky rings. I've got more where that came from. Real cheat, too. Interested? Hold on. One coin toss doesn't prove anything. Okay, fair. Let's go again. Heads or tails? Call it. Tails this time. We got tails! There. Happy? Not yet. One more time. Really? I mean... Fine. Heads or tails? Tails. We got tails! There. Happy? One more. Mister, come on. <laughs> okay. Heads or tails? Heads. We have heads! There. Happy? One more. Fine. Heads or tails? Heads. We have heads! There. Happy? One more. Heads or tails? Tails. We got tails! There. Happy? Again. You're killing me here, mister. You really <laughs> just take the ring, huh? Free sample. Now, you want to take a look at the other stuff I got? Or maybe you just want to go? Let me see what you have. You've got it. One sec. Freeing of being really invisible. Son. Are you selling crap? Nothing caught your eye, huh? It's nothing but junk. Be it from me to argue with that discerning eye of yours, sir. Anyway, see you again sometime. Take care. Safe travels. You realize your bag feels light. You were just robbed. You little shit. You taking something? Something that doesn't belong to you? Me? No, promise. I'm just a kid trying to make a living. You know who you should talk to? Mal. She's my... Boss, I guess. Good at finding stuff. Her office is through the crack in the wall over there, if you can fit. You've lied to me, I'll feed you to spiders. One piece at a time. I, look, mister, I don't want trouble. Just talk to Mal, okay? She's the one you need. Don't fucking steal from a drow, you idiot. I've been robbed. You seen anyone acting suspiciously? Tell me the truth or I'll feed you to a bear. Oh, I just got it. Uh, stop! Stop yelling at me or I'll call Mole. Your little friend doesn't frighten me. Before you can say anything else, she sprints away. Sprints down here. Get back here, you piece of shit. That's curious. Uh, no one can fit in that hole except for Donna. Looks like the goody two shoes has to sort this one out. Well, look who's come to visit. My kids say you've been busy since you got here. 
Not sure why you're poking your nose in our business, though. Hey, I don't even know what your business is. None of yours. This is our hideout. But hey, maybe you didn't know. Because of that, I'll give you a ten count to leave. You're joking, right? Nine. No, I'm gonna stay. Give me what you stole. Oh, it just ends? The thieves fled the hideout with your belongings. Probably won't see our stuff again. Rip! I had no dialogue options to actually say, hey, give my shit back. I'm guessing it's because, uh... I couldn't get, uh, Talon down here. Ah, my good friend! Ah, hello, Vola. Just now, no? I know you. Came, you saw them up I'm quite a fan of your books. I, I just wish uh, Wizards of the Coast was. There's no overstating my interest. Uh, not Wizards of the Coast. Fucking... Is it Wizards of the... Who am I thinking of? No, Wizards of the Coast does fucking uh, Magic the Gathering. Fucking, you know, the the people that actually write the D&D &D books. If you'll excuse me, I ought not to dawdle. Did, did, sir, did you just... Kiss my nipple. There was so much blood. Uh, I can still smell it. I'm sure your teacher would be there. God. It is so hard to actually, you know, like role play with like all of this shit and try and be these other characters when this idiot right here is fucking dyslexic. <laughs> Is your name Merkin? <laughs> Bruh, you're named after a pubic wig. Uh, focused by singing, there once was a lady who met, uh, met with a mirror and tried to disclose it to her foolish fellow. Okay. Yeah, let's... Oh, I can't fail this. The suffocating yearning suddenly fades as the spell breaks. You are free. Oh, I could just break that <laughs> by singing my own thing. The man would not listen. He thought it told tales until he rubbed against all of her scales. Ooh, scandalous. Ouch, my ears. Wait, why am I wet? <laughs> Wait, what, was my song so bad it counted the fucking harpy song? That's actually kind of funny. Uh, Tarlin, what the fuck are you doing over there? Excuse me? What happened? <laughs> Wait, what happened? What? How did both of them get there so quickly? Oh, Jesus. Okay. Uh, we, we swung. Did it hit? There we go. Yeah, kid, get the fuck out. You do not want to be here. Why did you run directly towards the... Okay. Okay, Egypt. That'll still hit him. Okay. That sucks, but it also feels like it's the best move I've got. Yeah, go magic missile. Have all of them just hit you. Uh, camera? Camera, yo, Jesus. <laughs> How much damage we, uh, did we do to it? Okay, we did half its health. Uh, Phoenix is charmed. Ah, shit. Oh, no. Okay. At least the uh, attack of opportunity knocked her out of it. 55% chance because low ground. Oh, are you fucking serious right now? Are you kidding me? How? How? Are you fucking kidding me? One fucking health? Alright, let's try a firebolt then. Egg miss strikes again. Yeah, just twat him with a stick. There we go. <laughs> oh, god damn. He kind of got a shit kicked in there. Hello, I would like to talk to the child. I would like to talk to the child. Am I unable to talk to said child? Well, that looks like that's bugged, so I can't actually finish that quest. Cool. Oh, right, that was technically a uh, interaction. So, guess we roll next. Hey, look who rolled a 17. Time to be a dick again. Oh, I gotta, I gotta talk to Korga. 
is <laughs> fucking tall and all. Oh, this is gonna be bad. Oh, this is not going to end well. Please. I'm sorry. This is madness, Korga. She's just a... A what, Wrath? A thief? A poison? A threat? I will imprison the devil. And I will cast out every stranger. I'm just gonna do nothing, just let it go. Wrath, lock her up. She remains here until the rite is complete. And keep still, devil. Teela is restless. Come, Koga. We took back the idol. Surely... Do it. Ooh, I have a monk thing. Act rashly as a cornered viper would. Free the child and oh, more tieflings will interrupt you. See, this is, this is weird. Is this... We're in a situation now where my class uh, counteracts what Tarlin wants as a character, which is to be a complete dick. Ah, uh, snake bite, snake bite. Ithias, Tila, to me. That's what you get for running. By the gods, Korga, what have you done? Bury the remains. Continue the right. And the parents? They're just outside. This outsider will take word once I've spoken to him. We must focus on the right. Jesus, all right. So since there's like no like evil option outside of just sit and wait, we just watched her kill a kid. Oh, fuck. Yeah, there's no good way of saying this. Uh, I have a tadpole in my head. A tadpole? A mind flare tadpole? Yeah, what other kinds are there? It's not like a frog hopped in my eye. What's that smell? Gimme. Let's take that for a rainy day. It might come in handy. Oh, I'm gonna have to give them the bad news. Unless you have news of Arabella, I don't want to hear it. Uh, there's no good way to say this. Uh... Koka kind of killed your daughter. Koka? Koka did... What? No. No! That snake! That... That... No. Ah! <laughs> yeah, thanks game. About that, we didn't, uh, save her. <laughs> told Arabella's parents what happened, they were devastated. As they fucking should be. Uh... I'm gonna try and block him out. No, get out of my brain. Your minds intertwine. You see his siblings, Andrik and Brenna. New recruits. Yours to shepherd. Protect them. I'm guessing they're adopted. There's no way... He... There's absolutely no way they're soul. biological kids. Fun facts, Dr uh, I was about to say droids. Dwarves can actually crossbreed in like D&D &D lore, but like when they do, uh, the babies always come out as full dwarves. I'm no true soul, what are you, what are you on about? What? What are you doing? Your sword brother, now! Oh, fight. <laughs> we didn't have to fight, I just wanted to help. I have no idea what the hell a true soul is. Oh, of course I miss a 75% rip. Alright, then we... Flurry of Blows. Oh, critical hit. Fuck you. Get out of here. Well, aren't you annoying? Oh, hey, good thing I have Shocking Grasp. I rolled a one? 
<laughs> I rolled one damage on Shocking Grass. Fuck off. There we go. All you had to do. All you had to do was not attack us. We were trying to be nice. Your limbs move of their own accord. There's something of value. Uh, what? Something your craves. Why let its host's memories go to waste? The tadpole has absorbed it all. Its experience could nourish you, strengthen you. Uh, what is stronger? Okay, that's... There we go. Roll the dice. Oh, I rolled a two! Oh, okay, well... Looks like... <laughs> looks like the brain worm wants it too bad. No use. Compulsion takes over. Your actions are no longer your own. Ew. Ew. Well, uh, guess I'll pocket his worm. Hey, at least has a bunch of stuff, though. Uh, shuff of broken spear. Oh, right. I should take that. Owlbear tracks. Its nest must be nearby. <laughs> so, yeah, the other half of that thing is in here. You feel the quake of its heavy footsteps before you see it. An owlbear. Its beaked face looming out of the darkness. Uh, hello, ma'am. What's this? Something weak. Something tender. Won't even have to chew you before I feed you to my son. Soft meat. <laughs> uh, sorry, Frog Cave, I'll be going. No. Uh, you're injured. There's still half a spear lodged in your head. Are you, are you okay? It's a splinter. I've gutted bigger threats than you with worse. Uh, uh, okay, uh, I'm good at both persuasion and intimidation, but I'm not an absolute prick, so I'm just gonna, yeah. Please just let us go. Plus seven. I gotta roll like a two to fail. Or a one? That works too. <laughs> that works too. Well then, uh, hi, madam. Uh, if you could, uh, do me a favor and, uh, be insulted by this, it would be, uh, fantastic. A miserable pile of secrets. A miserable pile of secrets. But enough talk. Have at you. <laughs> oh, saved. Ooh. Nearly killed Donner in a single hit. Ow. Ooh, actually, armor of Agathis would be really good right here. Uh, that takes, uh, yeah, that takes an action. What can I do as a bonus action? Oh, Misty Step. I keep forgetting I have that. <laughs> I keep forgetting you get Misty Step, like, pretty early. Later, bitch! What did you do? What did I do? Why are you mad at me? Oh, oh, 20 damage! Oh, why did you attack me, child? Why did you attack me? I have no fight with you. Okay, dissonant whispers. Please take damage. There we go. From you to his dead mother. Wake, hungry. A single strike will end his suffering. I'm not gonna kill him. I didn't want to fucking fight. Yeah, I'm just gonna let the creature live. Hungry, food. You watch speechless as the cub begins to eat his mother. Ew. Prolonged his misery. Oh, at least it healed. Well, I'll take that. All right. So, what's our inventory? Let's see, we combine this with, where is it? Right here. Ding, the vision of the absolute. 
Let's see. Absolute Knight. Blind targets that fail a dexterity saving throw deals an additional 2, uh, two to 12 piercing damage to certain creatures that sport multiple sets of eyes. I feel like I should give that to Talon. Because if he can't fucking wield it, then no one can. Ah, yep, he can he can use it. Technically does less damage than the uh, plus one quarter stuff. But, you know, blinds anything that fails the dex saving throw, plus a possible uh, 2 to 12 extra damage. Then considering he's a fucking drow, like this spear with skulls on it, like kind of fits. <laughs> medium armor so oh i can actually wear it because uh yeah didn't i take the uh bar tanking spec now i look like a country singer <laughs> uh okay let's uh oh right we're out of sh short rests well guess we're taking a long rest you don't sleep well flitting between dreams and nightmares maybe you wake up because you know something uh, is wrong beat or maybe you just get lucky. Uh, Starion, what the fuck? Shit. <laughs> yeah, shit indeed. What are you doing? No, no. It's not what it looks like. I swear. I... I wasn't going to hurt you. I... I just needed... Well... Blood. There, in the dim firelight, you see him for what he really is. A vampire. A slave to sanguine hunger. Of course. Melee attack, pick up a stake, lunge it at the monster. This is what I did the first time I played this game. <laughs> this is what I did. Because, like, he's an absolute dick. He's incredibly up his own ass. He is a rogue, which, you know, like, he fits a lot of the rogue stereotypes of just, you know, being a dick. Uh, and just being a fucking vampire trying to, like, suck my blood without fucking permission. Yeah, I'm gonna fucking murder him. <laughs> but, you know, for roleplay purposes. How long since you killed someone? Days? Hours? I've never killed anyone. Well, not for food. <laughs> I don't care how much you need, you're not drinking my blood. No. No, of course. Silly of me to even ask. I'll go and find something on four legs to eat, I suppose. See you in the morning. Uh, see, we'll talk about this in the morning, all right? All right. You watch him stalk away, slumped, sulking, and ready to kill. God, all I try to do is fucking sleep. It's what I get for trying to be nice to people. Uh, hey, Asterion. Yeah, what the fuck? Uh, where the fuck is Donna? How did you get up there? How the fuck did you get up here? I didn't even know you could get up here. Man, the AI tracking is really fucking goofy in this game. Oh, 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 we got it. Hold up, hold up. Hey, buddy. Keep moving, stranger. Quietly. You okay? What happened here? I told you to go. Look, I'm not an enemy. All right, I just want to know what happened. Ooh, I have animal friendship. Now I have advantage. Oh, ho, ho, two fives? Bruh. <laughs> I'm not going to intimidate the dog, especially one that just lost its master. Better. Thank you. Fucking advantage rolls two fives. Come on. You see a name etched into the leather. Scratch. Like you scratch, aren't you? Yeah, it, it, it's all right, man. You know my name. Interesting. A predator wouldn't care to learn it. See, Still, I told you. I'm. You should go. My friend is injured. He needs rest. He's more than injured, man. Of course he will. And then we'll return home. So what happened to him, exactly? We were attacked. We're cackling furry things on two legs. And their smell, it was strange, rotten, evil. 
Oh, I failed the nature check. Rip. Look, you can travel with me if you like. No, I won't leave him. Yeah, I, I, I get it. I get it. If it comes to that, I may. What? Thank you. Uh, so it was supposed to give me a, a, a dialogue option that says, like, hey, here's my scent. Meet me back at camp if, you know, he doesn't eventually wake up. That's what that response was, but I didn't get it. Huh. So I'm not sure if he will show up back at camp or not. Get over there! Surround him like! I know you're there. Show yourself. You spotted us. Good. It's like they say. No fun in skewing a pig what doesn't know he's cooked. Curious. At almost the exact same floor when we saw you. That's supposed to be a threat. Got a set on you, all right. Almost makes me like you. Almost. I'm gonna enjoy pulling off your skin when we're done. Alright, immediately a fight. Usually, a uh, thing pops up. It's like, hey, you have, like, your brain parasite thing. Convince them using that. But, uh, apparently not. Okay, just immediately into a fight. Oh, not Grace. Don't hit me with a fire spell. Ah, crap. Well. <laughs> that's not good. <laughs> Ferenix just fucking died. Just immediately failed all of his fucking death saving throws in the one turn. Yeah, I gotta... Oh, okay. I was already in the fire. That shouldn't have dealt extra damage to me. Okay. I was trying to get out of it so I could heal myself. Uh, yeah, heal myself and Donna. Ooh, blinded. Then we go with Flurry of Blows because fuck you in particular. I knew that first one would miss. I fucking knew that first one would miss despite having advantage and 94% chance to hit. Because that's just my luck, apparently. Well, there she goes. Oh, this sucks. Alright, it is just Talon now. Got some ranged options would be really good. <laughs> if only uh, this game had Sun Soul Monk. Oh, that's not a door. Okay. Fuck you. Alright. <laughs> Hey, Talon, want to be an absolute fucking pal and pick us up? There you go. Now get up. Get out of that. And Song of Rest. And Short Rest. Fuck. Oh, that sucks. Oh, that sucked so bad. Oh, we almost got TPK'd. Holy shit. Also, you know it'd be really good right now. Fucking animate dead. Hey Donna, you're a necromancer. How come you don't know animate dead? Glows. Power courses through you. Yeah, this was what was supposed to happen uh, in the previous conversation, but apparently not. Okay. You know what? Let's use friends. Cause we've we've been super unlucky. Yeah, like that. Yeah, we've been super unlucky with uh, dice rolls. Good thing I did. Otherwise, we wouldn't be fucked. Haste Helm, start a combat that wear against momentum for three turns. Oh, hell yeah. Uh, since the only one who actually goes into melee combat is uh, Talon. Alright, this one could be just as disastrous as last. <laughs> so uh, for those of you who actually watched my uh, Baldur's Gate 3 early access stream that I did, like, what was it, two, three years ago? Whenever that game first fucking went to early access. Uh, I tried conversing with these guys and they instantly fucking killed me. <laughs> Forget goblins. You should be fighting for me. I am, by all accounts, a student of higher commerce and extortion. Make me an offer. Tempt me. I'll pay you in the flesh of the fallen. You'll have your fill. Deceived Tony, I'll know. Oh no. Go on, big money, big money, no whammies, no whammies, stop. We actually fucking got it. 
Not gonna lie, I totally did not expect to get that first try. <laughs> I 100% just assumed we were going to, like, piss them off and start a fight. Oh my god, I can't believe I actually got that. Alright, <laughs> alright. Thank you, sorcerers having high charisma. Oh, it's actually a unique thing. Okay. Wait, what? Only <laughs> for a book. Excuse me. Oh, cool. The scale, bro. <laughs> Fisting time, oh god. Oh, these things spawn more. Oh no. Oh, this got a <laughs> this got out of hand real quick. Oh man, this thing is actually really good. Uh on Talon. Because if it blinds something, the next attack gets advantage. A magic mirror. You've read all about them, but never seen one up close before. Mirror mirror on the wall. Who's the fairest of them all? Oh you shit. You shit. Uh, I, I don't like whatever that is. Oh, I super don't like that. Oh, God. Open or I'll smash you to pieces. Bad luck be damned. There is a pause as those glass eyes take you in. Then... <laughs> Successfully intimidate a mirror. I don't like that everyone is failing a perception check. Oh. It was probably that. Good thing I didn't step on it. This looks interesting. Totally won't be bad. The book is locked tight with no visible keyhole. Only an oval recess in the cover's mouth. You try to examine the book, but the longer you stare, the more those piercing amethyst eyes draw you in. Uh, I guess I'll just put it away. Alright then. Like, probably something bad is going to happen with that, but at least it'll be interesting. Did Doggo actually show up? Doggo showed up. And animal friendship is still active. Hold up, I need it. Oh my god, I just realized they still haven't fucking swapped over my thing. Oops! <laughs> I knew that would happen. I knew that would happen eventually. God damn it. <laughs> I knew I'd fucking forget. So I was talking to like, what, three other people as uh, fucking what's ahead? God damn it. I'm an idiot. I'm an idiot. <laughs>